And Kevin, just curious, you know, a little bit of a shaky start offensively for you guys. What did you feel kind of turned things around, got you to the rhythm in the second half? Uh, I think we stayed with our defense. You know, our defense got us going there on the offensive side of the ball. We couldn't make shots. I felt like um, when we were trying to bust the game open, seven, eight points, we got open threes we didn't make. Um, we got our scores in position we didn't make. I know I missed a lot of bunnies that felt good leaving my hands. So, um, but we stuck with our defense. We didn't let that, um, you know, get in the way of what we wanted to do out there. Um, we helped each other and boxed out well. So we got to keep that same effort going into game two. Michael Grady with Yes Network. And just first off, just the energy in the building, the fans, what was it like being a part of a, a playoff atmosphere that you guys had tonight here in BK? It was incredible. You know, our fans were loud. They were there early. Um, they definitely gave us an advantage. Um, you know, and it was weird because, I mean, we haven't seen them all season, and it was 1,500 there, you know, last couple months of the season. But to see, you know, front row, People at the front row and then see more in the upper and lower bowl. It was pretty cool. And, uh, you know, I'm sure our fans enjoyed the win, but, you know, we want to play better for them as well. Can, can you explain the difference between, you know, regular season, the communication and the intensity versus getting that feel and that rhythm over the flow of a physical playoff game? Yeah, I mean, we prepared um, over the last five or six days and just our principles and details. And, you know, guys are locked in on what they need to do individually. And, you know, we just, you just feel the season. You know, you feel, you feel it in the air that it's playoff time. So guys are uh, understanding um, how much it takes each possession for us to be on that level of, like, um, playing great basketball. It's tough to do in the playoffs. So it's a good place to be right now. I'm glad we're here. I'm glad that um, we got this first one. Um, but we got to get ready for game two. Ryan Lewis with the New York Post. Hey, Kevin, the uh, slow start, how much do you attribute that maybe to Lee, obviously Block and everything inside? Maybe that's for guys at all, or is it you talked about fans, it's different having four thousand fans in here, maybe you guys were amped up trying to do too much. What, what do you attribute that to? I mean, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. We missed some good looks. I mean, they, they are definitely playing physical and helping a lot, so you got to give them credit for their defense, but... I mean, we, um, I think we missed some good looks, our shooters, uh, you know, missed some good looks. But for the most part, man, I think we came out there with a, a solid focus on the defensive side. And we was telling each other if we continue to do that in each possession, um, offensively we'll start to find a groove. And we definitely want to have more movement and make more shots. But if we're there on the defensive side of the ball, we give ourselves a better chance when we go through them lows of shooting. Greg Logan, Newsday. Uh, Kevin, uh, you came out really aggressive in the third quarter. You guys opened with an 18-4 run and, and never lost that lead. What was the key to that stretch, you know, where you just kind of took control of the game? Yeah, I think one in that second quarter when we got down 12 after uh, Jabari made that three, um, uh, we settled in a little bit. I know it sounds weird, but we came out of that timeout a little bit more settled and was able to cut the lead to six, and we knew uh, – you know, we looked at the score sheet. They made way more threes than us, and uh, we knew that our offense started to come around. So we just wanted to keep our physicality up on the defensive side. We got a couple stops to start the third and was able to cruise. Kevin, 